Hello and welcome back to our playthrough of the Stanley Parable. We just finished up with a pretty epic ending and um... Well, I think we're gonna go ahead and see what else we can find. Wonder how many more there are left. Or, oh, ooh. The phone's actually ringing. Good morning. Thank you for contacting the Future Happiness Foundation. The fuck? We are confirming your shipment of 1,327 cardboard boxes to your place of work. Can you verify that this is correct? Yes. Excellent. Your order will arrive shortly. Thank you again for contacting the Future Happiness Foundation. Cool. All right. This is the fourth input. How do we? Oh no. How do we? How do we? Maybe we have to climb up here to put the input. Four thirty-four. How do I? How do I input you? Oh. Input received. One of those quick clicks worked. Wonderful. Okay, so we have one more input that we have to find somewhere. And then that presumably unlocks another ending? Hopefully? We'll see, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Alright. Alright, what else is there? Um, oh, the press on. No, press off on the machine like he wanted us to. That's right, there's also that. Um, that's fine. All right, yeah, so let's go ahead and do that. I'm, I'm just waiting, oh, waiting, sorry. I'm just looking for another input to be pressed somewhere. Okay, uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Nope, none of these doors, which I should keep tr checking, you know. Two open doors, right, so left. He entered the door on his left. Yes, just as you asked. I have done. So, Mr. Narrator Man. Okay. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Okay, sweet. Do these open anymore? Oh! Okay, these still open. Okay. It's not really sure what triggered their openingness, but you know, whatever it was, hooray, <laughs> basically. Right, that's the elevator over there. That, I think, leads nowhere, ultimately. Um... The moment he what? Fuck. <laughs> oh no. We done goofed. I think we goofed. Oh god. I was gonna say... I wonder if we... Miss any of the computers. Like, if, if there's a computer in here that ha had an input, but now I can't check it. Shit. <laughs> I think I broke the game. Oh no. Is there a computer in here? I, f I forget. I don't think there's a computer in the bathroom. It doesn't make any goddamn sense, but sure. Okay, um... Wait, no, the door was... Hold on, hold on. The door was open this way when we came in. Now it's open the other way. Okay, maybe this is intended. Nope. We still have barks. Okay. Barks are still a thing. Can I disable the parks? No, don't go down. Down is the insane ending. Even though this is starting to get a little bit insane. If you uh, feel me. Can we disable bark? Is the, the bark command turn it off? Oh, thank god. No more barking. Okay. Any of these doors? Do anything? No? Maybe? Oh, right door is... Closed. Mm hmm. Okay. This door? No. This door. This door. Do we go just go back to our office? And then he tells us some other nonsense. 25, 426, 420. Yeah, 420 plays it. Oh, look at this. Look at this dank weed right here we got growing just right in the office. Mm hmm. Okay. That also does nothing. Okay. I am out of ideas other than. Just go back to our own office, I guess. Oh, 428 is apparently open. It's 428, right? 421? 4 I guess it is 428. Okay. Yeah, we're 427, so I guess this is 428. Sure. Oh, we restarted the game? No. We made it somewhere. Okay, you are now leaving. Sweet. Just what I wanted. 
754? What? Okay. Elevator has no actual pushable button. Wonderful. Escape pod bay. Floor 760. We're on 754. How many goddamn floors is this office? Holy crap. Okay. Also, apparently the narrator has decided to fuck off forever. Maybe he's continuing the story with us in that other room. With the boss. Oh, right, because he kept saying, like, Oh, yeah, Stanley pushed these buttons to open that uh, keypad. So maybe he's continuing to believe that we're at 30. 7. Does that not change? Maybe he's continuing to believe that we're standing there waiting for it, for us to push those buttons to open that secret passage while we're actually out here spelunking. Yeah, apparently this room is just the same room every time. You know, spelunking and uh, trying to find a way out. Yeah. Okay. Hopefully this is just not an endless set of stairs. 58. Still 430 out there. Okay. Apparently every single floor is identical. Which is a little sad if you think about it. Um, who knows how many other Stanleys are in this place. Coexisting in this in similar stories. Oh. Just straight up no lights anymore. Okay. Escape pod launch bay. We made it? The scape? Please? For real this time though? Can't tell if I'm moving. Just look at the door so I can actually see that I'm walking away from it. Okay, there we go. Now there's actually something to see. Um. Oh. What is this? Wait, that's it? Did we... Wait, did we Wait, was that from the escape pod? Welcome Stanley to heaven. Oh my god. <laughs> it's just a bunch of buttons. What should we push all of them? Does it do anything? Oh, they're saying buttons in the background. Buttons. Buttons. Um, I don't know if we like messed up these. Anyway, I think that's the end of the buttons ending. Uh, yeah, I don't know if we messed up the game or something, because there was that like weird loading screen for the escape pod. But, I don't know. Can we? No, it's locked. Okay. All co-workers were gone. What? What could it mean? Stanley decided yeah, to go to the end. meeting. Okay. Perhaps he simply missed a memo. Bonders are now different no again. No matter how hard Stanley looked, he couldn't find a trace of his co-workers. Is this because we did the buttons? Ascension ending? Maybe? Okay, um, I, I have a feeling I somehow messed up that um, escape pod ending. I think I'm gonna go. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. I think, hold on, I'm gonna go ahead and pause the episode here real quick. Check it on you. Hello, and I have come back from YouTube. <laughs> right, so apparently that's exactly what the ending was. It's just you get in the pod and there's no actual like cinematic or anything that explains or shows how you got out, so that's fine. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Yes. Boss's office also had nope, no, that computer is not showing that weird Stanley Parable logo on it. Into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any human life. What could it mean? He wondered. Desperate for answers, he began turning the room over, looking for clues that might unravel the situation. Until at last, he discovered a keypad behind the boss's desk, but alas, no code. For this keypad guarded the terrible secret that lay buried below his feet. And so the boss had assigned it an extra secret pin number. 
2845. But of course, yet incredibly, by simply pushing random buttons on the keypad, Stanley happened to input the correct code by sheer luck. Amazing. Oh, can I go down there? He stepped into the newly opened passageway. Hmm. Probably not. All right. So what do we have left? Um. Off. Off on the power switch. That's right. Off on the power switch. I should look up to see what the if there are any others actually that that were here. Yeah. After this ending, we'll look up to see if there are any other endings that we have missed. Um, I would imagine there are a few. The large door that read Mind Although I can't facility. think of any. Necessarily. I don't know why the voice that I'm doing is now this one. But don't question it, it's the fine. The on an enormous room packed with television screens. What horrible secret did this place hold? Stanley thought to himself. Did he have the strength to find out? We have the strength. So don't don't even worry about it, narrator. We got the strength. Now the monitors jumped to life. Their true nature revealed. Each bore the number of an employee in the building. Stanley's co-workers. The lives of so many individuals reduced to images on a screen. And Stanley, one of them, eternally monitored in this place where freedom meant nothing. Okay. And then we push you, and then the elevator comes, and then we go on. This on and up. Control facility. It was too horrible to believe it couldn't be true. At Stanley, I wonder if any of these have any like Easter eggs in them. This time? Was this the only reason he was happy with his boring job? That his emotions had been manipulated to accept it. There's like some kind of red text over there. Oh, we, oh, we should have. I wonder if we can get back there. Now this thing is locked off, right? Yeah, it's closed. Okay. Maybe there's another version of it somewhere? I don't know. I would imagine there's something in here somewhere that is an easter egg or something. If you looked over it long enough. Just, just gonna keep looking for like a couple of seconds if anything just... ...pops out at us. Nope. 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 Nothing really... Nothing really... Nothing really pops out. Okay. We can go back. Well, there you go. There's, we have a, we have maybe created a third ending. Do this. No, there's nothing. Can we just walk back? No, because the door's closed after us. It definitely did close. Maybe there's like something here that we missed. What? Oh God! Oh. <laughs> William hides the best secrets. There is no turning back. Don't touch the secrets. Once you go secret, disco secrets. Secrets mode engaged. Secret of the year every year. Never give up on your secrets. Happy secrets. Super secrets. Woo! Now that was a good secret, let me tell you. So good it scared the shit out of me. Oh, damn it. No, he refused to believe it. The disco he is gone. He couldn't accept it. His own life in someone else's control? Never. It was unthinkable. Wasn't it? Was it even possible? Had he truly spent his entire life utterly blind to the world? All right. But here was the proof. The heart of the operation. Controls labeled with emotions. Happy or sad. Or content, walking, eating, working, all of it monitored and commanded from this very place. And as the cold reality of his past began to sink in, Stanley decided that this machinery would never again exert its terrible power over another human life. That's right. For he would dismantle the controls once and for all. We finally finish with the proper and best probably hopefully ending unless some kills me also but we have no way of knowing that until we actually push the off button boom oh we, we killed everything nope nope wonderful oh, wonderful oh ooh. there's some music blackness 
and a rising chill of uncertainty. Was it over? Yes. He had won. Oh, well, this is actually the victory ending. He the machine. Unshackled himself from someone else's command. Freedom was mere moments away. And yet, even as the immense door slowly opened, Stanley reflected on how many puzzles still lay unsolved. Where had his co-workers gone? How had he been freed from the machine's grasp? What other mysteries did this strange building hold? But as sunlight streamed into the chamber, he realized none of this mattered to him. For it was not knowledge or even power that he had been seeking, but happiness. Perhaps his goal had not been to understand, but to let go. No longer would anyone tell him where to go, what to do, or how to feel. Whatever life he lives, it will be his. And that was all he needed to know. It was, perhaps, the only thing worth knowing. Stanley stepped through the open door. That's right. Stanley felt the cool breeze upon his skin, the feeling of liberation, the immense possibility of the new path before him. This was exactly the way, right now, that things were meant to happen. And Stanley was happy. So I guess we finally, quote unquote, beat it? Yeah, beat the game, achievement unlocked, there you go. Huh. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and open up, uh... Oh, this is still, right, we can redo the heaven waiting, the heaven ending if we really want to, I suppose. Um... Unless... No, we definitely finished it, I think. I don't think there was gonna be anything more, it was just going buttons, buttons, yeah, buttons, buttons. Anyway, so I'm going to Google real quick. Uh, let's see here. Stanley Parable. Stanley Parable Endings. Stanley Parable Endings. Oh, Images is probably much more useful than what I would have done otherwise. You image. Let's see here. All right, start of game. Sometimes blue office whiteboard. Yeah, we did that. Launch options, consoles, SV cheats here. Ooh, okay, we haven't done that. Apparently, we can do one with a console. Heaven, that's the button one. Face punch, texture change. Nope, still haven't done that. Just type face punch, like in the keyboard, maybe. Okay, door reluctant. Oh, door close reluctant. Okay, that's the one we did where we didn't want to leave. Window 434, yes and no on jumping out. Okay, yep, yeah, we got both of those. Door choice right, hallway. Left door maintenance elevator confusion. So that's when we went down in the elevator, right? Okay. Forward cargo, upwards, phone, work, and choice, right? The first time we answer it, he goes into the whole meta analysis. And then we, if we unplug it, he's like, what the fuck? You weren't supposed to be able to do that. Okay, cargo death is when you jump down, right? Jump on catwalk, door, choice, red, space ending, right? That's when we, then we would commit suicide. Um, the art endings if you play for four hours or do the hacks the way we did it. Uh, baby game games. Oh, that's, that's probably Portal and the Minecraft one. Okay. Fair enough. Where else? We, okay, back here. The broom closet one we've done. Staircase down insane. Yes, we did do that one. That's where he jumps out the window or whatever and somebody else finds him. Um, up, boss, back out, escape pod. All right, we did that even though that was kind of a meh ending if you ask me uh boss third elevator okay yep we did that one keypad 2845 secret disco we accidentally walked in that one okay escape museum yeah that's the one that had all the game dev shit the power then on bomb yep that's the one that killed us power off life okay so really the two ones that we're missing is sv cheats one and face punch all right let's do face punch first face punch but Stanley simply couldn't what? handle the pressure. Oh, spacebar probably. Okay, hold on. Begin the game again. Yeah, yeah spacebar probably was like interact, or one of the ones we pressed was interact. So let's just look at nothing. Face punch. Oh. All right then. Everything is face punch. <laughs> Does Just anything? Step through this door. No, nothing changes. Thought to himself, that's oh, what the all fuck? I need. If I can make it through this door, I can make it through them all. 
Does this actually do anything? No, it's just just all the textures are replaced. Okay, sure. Now we the other one was uh console was it S V underscore Chia eight one. Enter. There you go. Stanley, this is me being serious. In fact, this is my serious room. It's where I come to be serious. <laughs> that table is the most serious table I could find. That's very serious. I looked at many, many tables, hundreds of tables. It's possible I looked at over a thousand tables. I honestly don't know. The specific number isn't as important as the understanding that of all tables I looked at, this one is the most serious. It's very serious. I relate this story to so impress upon you the extent to which this is the most serious room I have, which is why I brought you here. You just tried to activate server cheats, which of course runs the risk of breaking the entire game. You've got no respect for the strict order of scripted narrative events, and I just can't have that. <laughs> it's time to get serious, Stanley. No jokes, no games. Outside of this room, I might be more tolerant of those things, but now we're in the room. It is the serious room, so we know it's I'm serious. you to the most serious punishment I can think of. One hundred billion trillion years standing here in the serious room. Perhaps after that, we can talk about the severity of your actions and whether you've learned anything. But until then, serious room, go. Nope, serious room has no exit. And I'm assuming serious room has no further interaction to be had with. Okay, so there you go. Serious room. That's the last one, I think. Unless there's any more, unless there are any more achievements that I can think of. Actually, let me let me do that since we're here. Why not? Uh, a bunch of eights. Click on the door for thirty-five times. Play Stanley Tuesday for the entire duration of a Tuesday. Speed run. Complete the game in four minutes and twenty-two seconds. Go outside. Don't play Stanley Parable for five years. Okay, unachievable. It is impossible to get this achievement. All right, so I guess that's that then. We have. Well, we've done all the endings as far as the internet is concerned, so I guess that's the last episode of the Stanley Parable. Th there you go. <laughs> Thank you for joining me for this strange experience, everyone, and narrator, <laughs> and, and Stanley especially, I guess. And uh, yeah, we'll come back with, I think, the Beginner's Guide next. But until the Beginner's Guide, you know, it's it's been it's been fun. But until then, it's been it's been me, Stanley, and you, the narrator, playing the Stanley Parable. G goodbye. <laughs>